I used to live in a gap, in a valley, in the space between. Between who I actually was and what I allowed to be seen. You see, as a teen, I had it pretty rough. And not because my upbringing was particularly tough, but because of arrogance and pride, I got myself caught up into some pretty stupid stuff. Selfishness, hypocrisy, lying and cheating. I tried to break out, but the cycle kept repeating. And I did everything I could to hide the life I was really leading. To make sure that nobody knew. And I was succeeding, because I'd hidden it from view. Or so I thought. But just because you're not getting caught doesn't mean there's not a battle being fought and I kept losing and the sins kept bruising and I'm not trying to skirt responsibility because it was completely my choosing. Then one day, in front of a bunch of Christians, I was asked to tell my story. And at first, I, I thought, hell no, that'll be way too gory. They'll scream for my head when they find out I'm spiritually dead. They'll skin my hide when they see what's really inside. But somehow, I opened my mouth and I spoke and I spoke and I spoke until I cried. And what happened next, I'll never forget. Instead of casting me out with judgmental stares, after sharing my story, others started telling theirs. Addiction, jealousy, lying, unforgiveness. It seemed that everybody there had some secret sickness. Everyone was struggling. Everyone was weak. Just needing someone to give them the courage to speak or the permission. So I made it my mission to tell my story. You see, everyone has a secret that needs to be spoken. Everyone has a silence that needs to be broken, but someone has to be the first one to talk. Someone has to be brave enough to share their walk. Even if you feel like it's more of a crawl, don't be ashamed. We all fall. And the biggest problem is believing the lie that you're the only one, so don't stall, run, and tell your story. I'm not saying you have to tell all, but if you feel it, answer the call and tell your story in the right time and the right place. Remove the mask from your face and weave a tale full of grace. Tell your story. Tell it far and tell it near. Tell it to anyone who will hear. Tell your story. Not just for yourself. Not just for others. Tell it for His glory.